I know that tomorrow will be your evaluation as an mm -hmm. intern because I was scared. Like when I read your project, <laughs> I was scared. <laughs> I was scared for you and for myself. Yeah, I'd love to le leave you in one day. Hello and welcome. This is Coffee with Smoke and today we have a guest. And our Hi. guest is Jay. Jay is intern here at Amazon and he kindly agreed to join us on our show. <laughs> So this is a first guest of mine. I'm uh, very pleased to have you. Well, uh, all mine. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jay, tell us a bit about yourself. So you're an intern here. Yeah. Where are you from? Uh, so I came from Portugal. Um, I study computer science in Lisbon. And this summer, I spent it all in London interning at Amazon with Rafal, who's my mentor. Oh. So you decided to give up your summer uh, in Portugal. Yeah. Come in London, uh, known for its awesome weather, <laughs> uh, awesome, awesome uh, climate and fantastic beaches. Yeah, for Unlike sure. Lisbon. <laughs> uh, so was it hard for you to like decide on the step and oh, risk? I'd say it wasn't hard at all. Doing an internship at a big company like Amazon is something that I wanted for a long time. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, when I knew that I got it, I just said yes. I didn't think twice about it. It was something that I wanted for a long time and I, I was sure I wasn't going to regret it. Mm -hmm. So how do you like London so far? Do you enjoy it here? Uh, I like it a lot. Like London is one of the few cities in Europe where you can find anything that you want, be it like uh, if you want anything related to art, culture, uh, very niche specific things. London is one of the few places in Europe where you can find it. Like it's a great place and uh, I, I'd love to let, live here one day. You end up getting a better life here uh, if you don't count rent and some services which mm -hmm. are much more expensive. Mm -hmm. Basically more buying power. I think uh, that's yeah. the yeah, correct term. Yeah. Yeah. I understand like the whole transition to London and to Amazon was bit hard like an adventure but at the same time you know how was it uh yeah it was a, a shock at the beginning but i think when you come here and you start dealing with the people here you realize that everything's much more chill than what you might have uh, thought about before you actually came basically what you're saying was you are not afraid to leave portugal come to london it's like, uh, ah. yeah it's like when uh, you're afraid of things but at the same time your response to being afraid is just like ignoring the fact that you're afraid and going head on and kind of forgetting that you're afraid some people deal with it that way i think this was an experience and i dealt with my fear that way and everything turned out okay so yeah right did you manage uh, lodging accommodation transport of your things by your own or did you have any help uh, i did it on my own so transport of my things I just brought what I brought on a plane so that was easy mm -hmm. and accommodation Amazon referred uh, one student accommodation here in London which takes uh, internees during the summer so I spoke with them and I arranged my own accommodation through them all right so basically no-brainer yeah everything laid out for you exactly That's fantastic like when I was mm, applying to different uh, jobs back in my time um, I often heard about this, uh, you know, notion that interns all often do unimportant tasks mm -hmm. like brewing coffee, running for uh, office supplies, mm -hmm. back and forth. But you've been tasked with something that I would consider difficult for me, right? Mm -hmm. When I read your task, I was kind of worried that I'm going to be your mentor. Yeah. And at the same time, I don't really understand the task in its entirety. Right, and there is a lot of sections that I don't know how to help you with, mm -hmm. and I was worried that you know you're gonna ask questions. I won't have answers. Uh, so yeah, the the project that they gave me was uh, design or redesign this whole feature of our product, and yeah, as you said, it wasn't completely straightforward or just fetch coffee <laughs> yes. type of task. So this is your what? Eighth, ninth, ninth week today. Right? Uh, yeah, ninth week. Yeah. So total is ten weeks. Mm -hmm. And how are you liking it so far? 
So I'm loving it here. So when you're an intern, you're given a project to, to work over the summer. So you get to design your own feature, your own like little piece of something that is used by thousands of people. And you get tons of feedback for from amazingly talented people. And you get to incorporate all that and get a lot of help and just grow over the summer. Probably like ne I've never like grown before, I'd say. Don't worry, you'll have plenty of that <laughs> <laughs> to come. Given your experience so far, could you say that you learned a lot? What have you learned actually here in Amazon? Uh, I'd say that uh, computer science related things, I've learned a lot about code quality, about testability, making sure things not only work, but they work properly and everything is in place for, for the future and for other people especially because when you code for yourself or on college projects, you don't care so much about that, but here it's really important and I've started to uh, really care about those aspects of my code. And I'd say that the thing that I got most from my internship here is actually dealing with other people, talking to customers, being able to write good documents that other people can understand. And what people usually call soft skills are something that you really need then I think they should be as hard as the other ones. Yes. So having that said, I think that, forgive me, but I don't know, but I think uh, that in university you don't get really work on design docs or any sort of documentation, right? This is not a part of... Uh, no, it's mostly you get, okay, so do this and then you do it and it's in, you submit it and mm -hmm. that's it. So what parts of like the college knowledge mm -hmm. are is actually important what, what parts of this knowledge is helping you i'd say that what you get from college in computer science is mostly the experience of like knocking your head on the table and getting things to work at the beginning things don't seem it seems almost impossible how you can do the things they ask you but after like a week of extreme struggling you came out and you say okay I made this and it works and I think what you get from college is mostly the experience of being terrified and having no idea how to make this thing work and then you're actually able to do it and then you come to a place like this and you get a little bit of the same feeling but since, since it's something that you've known before and you've dealt with and you got past you come here and you're not so stressed about it because you know okay I've been in this situation before like I had no idea how to do things then I learned here is gonna be the same. Mm -hmm. No need to panic. Mm -hmm. So stress of or rather fear of ambiguity mm -hmm. and navigating around that fear, this is something that I yeah, it's kinda important to like understand that mm -hmm. oh, even if you don't know something, there are people that will help you, guide yeah, exactly. you and like direct you into a way like you can reach out and you get the help. So let's try this. <laughs> I know it's a hard one. Yeah. So what would you say is the best thing at Amazon so far? Uh, so I, I don't have much of a reference because it's my first internship, my first experience with a real company. So I really can't compare it to other things, but I've loved the people I work with, uh, the work I'm doing and the work-life balance is, is great. The salary as well, <laughs> can't ignore that. Uh, yeah, and the environment in the company, I think overall it's great. You don't feel over pressure to, to, I think it's a good balance of everything. Okay, good. Happy to hear that. Yeah. So a trick question. What has surprised you the most in Amazon? What did you not expect and it happened or did you have any expectations and they didn't happen? Uh, Again, since this was my first internship, I, I literally had no, I didn't know what to expect. I, I came in like getting ready to accept things that came my way. Mm -hmm. uh, what surprised me the most? Um, I'd say it was mostly how uh, I was expecting a big corporate environment and what I ended up with was like a, a four person team and with the same dynamics that I would have in like a group project in school. So that was really nice. That's great to hear. Yeah, yeah I think that was the thing that that, uh, that was more against my expectations. Okay. And it was a good thing. I think 
when you come to a place like this, you really learn to talk to people to just, okay, you don't know how this, how this part of the software works. Who You talk to Raf, who did this part of the software? They mm -hmm. tell, talk to someone, even if he doesn't know, he points you in the right direction. You go, you speak to them, people are super friendly. They tell you like, okay, so explain you what's going on, what you need to do to achieve what you want to achieve. And you start learning like your surroundings like that. Mm -hmm. Were you scared? Uh, at the beginning, yeah, like it can be a little intimidating, but when you get past your fear, and I think you real you realize that you can, but yeah, like mm -hmm. because I was scared, like when I read your project, <laughs> I was scared. <laughs> I was scared for you and for myself. <laughs> yeah, but I think it's the thing that I talked about you that you gain from college. Yeah, it's scary, but you know that in the end you're gonna get there. Mm -hmm. That's great. So, would you recommend the internship? in Amazon to others. Yeah, I would for sure recommend the internship. So uh, these three months just flew by. They were like super fun. I didn't, I almost didn't feel like I I was like slaving and working and not being at the beach. It, like it just went smoothly. And I recommend it to anyone because you get great experience. Amazon looks great on your CV either way. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and uh, the work is interesting. You meet tons of great people. Uh, they organize like a lot of events for interns. You can have fun with people your own age as well. And at the end, it's just a summer well spent. And you also manage to make a little bit of money over the summer, which is always good as well. Right. So um, I know that tomorrow will be your evaluation as an mm -hmm. intern. So I wish you all the best. Thank Good you. luck. <laughs> Have my fingers crossed. Yeah. And I'm hoping that you'll get an offer because yeah, yeah I don't know if you guys know, but uh, every internship here in Amazon, or at least almost everyone, uh, is like finalized with um, reviewing the project that intern did, and you may end up getting an offer from Amazon. So that's what I wish to you, Jay. Yeah, I wish that as well. <laughs> Let's right. see what happens. Um, anything else you want to add? Um, no, I think that's mostly it. I think I covered a lot of things that I myself had questions about before mm -hmm. I came. So I, I hope it, it helps someone who's considering it at least. Right. So people shouldn't be afraid of relocation and living. In... No, I mean, it's just a great experience. Like, you, you grow so much and it's totally worth it. Even if you're scared, just ignore that. Just go. Okay. So thank you so much, Jay. No, thank Thanks you. for joining Coffee with Smoke. <laughs> uh, and you just have to reach. Yeah. And yeah, don't be afraid. I'd say that's the most important thing. Thanks so much for joining. And remember, you can always do a comment and subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye. Cheers. <laughs>